Hello everybody! And of course I said that I was going to try out the Metroid Dread demo. Let's pretend that I never got the full game. And maybe I want to try the demo to see if I would really like the full game. See what the demo version has to offer. And I'm not going to go to the Nintendo eShop. I'm going to try the demo. See if that would have persuaded people to buy the full version. So here we go. And I think that's fine. Safety settings, yes, it's fine. Normal mode. Thank you very much. Let's pretend that I didn't have this game. Instead, I want to try the demo. See if I would like this game. See if the demo would persuade me to get the full version. So far, it looks like the same uh, story as the full version of the, of the actual game. Of course, this is the beginning. Of course, I already knew about this when I did my review of this game and when I did walkthroughs and challenges. And I, of course, I already know what happened next. Says the same story. And then shows you the story around the town of Metroid Fusion. It has the same story as the uh, full version. The question is how long this demo is. I will find out. That's the EMMI. And of course, it's deadly and it has the killer poke. Right. If I was, if I had played the full version, I wouldn't have known that. I would have realized, oh, that, that's different. E M M I, huh? I'd be saying it like that. All right, so here we go. Nope, she doesn't care. Let's see what <laughs> I'm gonna try. I'm gonna, she would be saying, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna one thing. So 
all I'm going to know is how long will the demo last. And it has the same uh, thing as uh, as if you were playing the full game. Of course, it's the beginning. So so far, it's all the same. the same thing. question is how long will the demo last? Same amount of and has the same health force. So far it has the same everything that the full version has. about it. Okay. Uploading data. So, you've accessed the network station. Well done, Samus. I have reviewed your vital signs and video log from the data you uploaded. I've run a full analysis, but I cannot account for why you lost consciousness. My readings indicate dramatic physical changes in you. Whatever caused these changes seems to have stripped you of most abilities. You might call it physical amnesia. That brings me to your assailant. I am checking the Federation database against your video law. It appears to have been a chosen. The attacker's identity is not yet clear. I have determined that you are somewhere within the depths of ZPR. Your top priority should be to return to your ship on the surface. This situation is precarious. Trust your instincts as you navigate upward. This planet appears to consist of multiple areas, shuttles, elevators, and other modes of transport connect up. Keep an eye out for ways to reach the surface. The ship's location is marked on your global map. Check it for yourself. 
You may encounter pockets of low temperature. Your methyl DNA renders you vulnerable to such environments. Spending time in cold areas will be harmful to you. There are many such cold areas scattered underground. Do not enter them with your basic power suit. One final thing. Underground interference is preventing radio transmissions. Check in with me at any network stations you find. Okay, so the only thing about the demo is you can't save. And that's the map, and that's the option. Okay. I've already done that. I knew about that. just about everything except you can't save that's the only that's the only thing about it that you can't all right and you can do rookie mode that's the only other thing rookie I know what rookie mode has you get 30 uh, 30 missiles instead of 15. That's the only difference. But the difficulty is a little different. was it <laughs> yeah, I screwed up big time because of the aiming that was one of the big problems that I had with the game is the aiming and now you know why that's my aiming was my biggest point well I did at that time but I wish the aiming could have been a little better. Not impossible. Alright. I think I can go this way now. Even though this is a safe slot, I don't think I can do it. Okay. 
that's not the only set. another one right there. Yeah, I'm just trying to demo to see how long this will go. And if I did the demo instead of the full version for gameplay and review, would I still give it a green card? For just the demo only. Of course, let you go. That's no surprise. Okay. I just want to know how long the demo is. Uploading data. Any you encountered were clearly trying to capture you. They may have been hacked. If so, it's reasonable to assume all Emmy will be possible. Emmy sent out a calls to detect vibrations in the air within a certain range. He calls they can hear you. He calls it Emmy. Upon detecting vibrations, an Emmy enters surveillance mode to track their source. Stay out of its line of sight when this happens. Otherwise, the danger to you increases dramatically. An enemy that has seen you will begin pursuit. Part of the pursuit protocol is to seal the enemy's own exits. You will be trapped inside. To survive, you must leave its range of pursuit. Evade the enemy and it will disengage. This will also unseal the exits. An enemy never leaves its assigned zone. Their control system must permit them to operate only within that range. I estimate a 99% probability of death if an enemy captures you. There may be a very small opportunity to escape, but exploiting this window will be virtually impossible. The enemy are immune to your current weapons. You lack the unique energy used to defeat the first enemy. Your only option now is to evade capture and find an exit. Your highest priority in an enemy zone should be simply to survive. All right. I 
I just want to see how long the demo is. Nope, it's pretty long. I'm still going to activate this sucker even though it's not an option. Alright. So far, the demo is pretty long, so... Let's do the map. Probably only at this location that I probably will be able to go. I'm not talking about the one part of this. And that's Artea. Probably the only location in this number that's allowed. I know. way this time. Chode. And obviously you have to go this way. I have no choice. Oh, I know this one. You have to... Trick it. Come on, I didn't want to do that. Oh, it's already done. Okay. Okay, thank you. Ooh. So far, this is a pretty long demo. So far, about a half an hour. I see how long this is going to last. The thing about it is, it's so far last. Okay, now I got the charge again. I just want to figure out how long the demo was. I already know what the charge beam does. I think it's just for this part of the game. So, this is gonna, so it was really pointless to do. It would have been really pointless to do walkthroughs and challenges on this episode. 
energy tank, the first energy tank. Of the demo, I should say. really nothing with the demo. Like if you're playing the full version. I wouldn't be able to do the get do the demo on gameplay and reveal. How long this has been so far when it comes to the demo. But I'm gonna play until until the demo ends. And once the demo ends, I'll... Of course, you probably already know how, how I would feel about it. Ah, bullseye. So that means I'm getting closer. I didn't think he was going that way. Nope, kill it both. I'm doing the demo only, so it really makes no difference. <sighs> kill it poke. Skip this crap. Makes no difference where I go. Fine, screw it. I'm gonna go this way. I didn't collect that. And because I didn't collect that, that was wrong of me. Not right. Yeah, this would have been a very long time if I would have did this for a game plan deal.
that's okay. I was gonna have to do this regardless. That's something different. I don't think that was ever in the main game. But I could be wrong. Okay, this is the It's just too easy. You know I'm playing the demo. It's practically the same as the main game. It's 
So if you were playing the main game, or if you were playing the demo first, you're, you're practically playing the main game too. It's a, I assume short because of how demos are. Probably do the I think this was a boss, but I'm not so certain. And this could be the last part of the game, but I'm not sure. And this sucker that launches you eventually your butt on. Decisions. And then he'll reverse and put his butt on you. Surprise, surprise.
Yeah, at him. I wasn't talking much because I'm. Yeah, that's it. I wonder if that's going to be it for the demo, that's the question. Then get the family to go. Okay, I don't need to explain anything about the Phantom Cloak. That's it. That's it for the demo. Woo! It was a pretty long demo, I'll tell you that. So I probably wouldn't have been able to do a game plan review on it because of how long it was. And so I, I will say I made a good decision just to do the main game instead of the demo. But I will say, had I done the demo instead of the main game for game plan review, I probably still would have given the game a green card like I did with the main game. So, so I'm glad I bought the main game. So, no question about it. The demo was fun, and uh, for people that want to try this demo before trying the full version of Metroid Dread, go right ahead. But trust me, buying the full version is definitely well worth it, especially when I've already reviewed it and I've done a one walkthroughs and challenges on it. I did the demo as a special treat for you guys. Someday I might actually do a hard mode for Metroid Dread you guys for walkthroughs and challenges in the near future. So I'm going to accept. And no, I would not. I already got the game, so I'm not really. So I don't really need to go to the eShop. So that is it, folks. That is it for the demo. It, it was a long demo, didn't it? than I expected, but that's okay. And of course, here's the big surprise. I'm doing another part for Super Mario Odyssey tomorrow. So hopefully you will enjoy that. And Deal No Deal episode will be on Monday. So I thank you all for watching this demo of Metroid Dread. Try the demo out for yourself, see if you like the demo, and you probably will like the demo, trust me. And if you like the demo demo enough, then you'll probably get the main game. Either through the eShop or buying a physical copy, like I did. Alright folks, if you like this video, please subscribe, and there's a notification bell. Click on it for future videos. You will get notified. And there's more videos to come. Stay safe and stay awesome. And happy gaming.